this video, we are going to see a problem on calculation of shear stress. Here we have a question. A 12 mm diameter circular pin in double shear carries a force of 12 kN. Determine the induced shear stress. I'll write the data for this question. Here it is given that a 12 mm diameter circular pin, so I'll denote it by D, it is 12 mm, in double shear. Now let me explain the meaning of this double shear with the help of a diagram. In double shear means there will be three plates attached with the help of a pin so here as we can see we have one two and three three plates which are connected with the help of this pin Now, here we have a pin which connects three plates and then since it is given that the pin is in double shear that is why we have three plates connected. If it was single shear then it would have been only two plates which were connected. Now, after this they are saying that it carries a force of 12 kN. Here I am denoting load P which is acting towards left. P by 2 and P by 2. These loads if I add them that will give me the value of P. So it is clear that from the diagram middle plate is being pulled towards left with the help of force P. The plates which are at the top and bottom, they are carrying the load which is half of P. So they are trying to pull the plate towards right. Now because of these two unequal directions, what can happen is this pin, it can break at the junction of the plates like this. And when it breaks, here we have three pieces. So I can draw the diagram and explain it in a more better manner. So this pin would be breaking in this form and how many areas do we have here? First I am getting an area here and similarly there would be an area here as well. So this indicates one pair of area. Next here I am getting one pair of area. Another is here. So one pair of area at the top, one pair of area at the bottom. That is why it is a case of double shear. And it is shearing in two parts as we can see here. So here, here this is a case of double shear. The question is determine the induced shear stress. So we have to find out how much is the shear stress which is induced in this pin or we can say rivet. So to calculate the shear stress let us start with the calculation of shearing area first. As I have told this is a case of double shear so we would be getting two pair of area. So I will write down in the solution part the cross section is a circle. having diameter D it is equal to 12 mm and since we have seen it is a case of double shear 
so here I'll write down it is double shear now therefore shearing area is equal to for double shear we have to multiply by 2 and it is pi by 4 into d square so capital A is equal to 2 into pi by 4 diameter is 12 square so this value comes out to be 226.19 mm square now after getting this shearing area we have to go for the calculation of induced shear stress tau since induced shear stress is given by tau is equal to force upon area therefore tau is equal to force is given as 12 kilo newton so 12 into 10 raised to 3 upon area is 226.19 so i'm getting the value of shear stress as 53.05 newton per mm square so this is the answer as we have seen in this problem the question was to calculate the induced shear stress and this induced shear stress which is there in this pin or rivet we have found out it is 53.05 newton per mm square and with this we complete the question